pretty much everything I do requires logs, so I don't want to waste a video just cutting down trees for two hours. So I'm going to cut down trees for two hours and talk at the same time. Fun. Oh yeah, um, everyone has been kind of um, asking me about mods, or my mods in particular, or the ones I use. Um, I'm going to put them on the screen because I can't remember the names of them. Um, this is the island one. Uh, the island that we're going to take over is called Elijah Island, based off the GZA one. Um, and... The main mods that I would recommend are just car mods because they're the ones that really make the best difference. Like for example, the car that we've ruined, uh, that can carry a lot and is relatively fast. Um, as well as the red truck uh, from the Fireman's one. The other thing is, because it's a mod, it won't be in a lot of the places that you'd expect to find standard car parts because they have um they basically make they basically make it as a so this car over here is a standard like that will take standard parts whereas the bigger cars will take heavy duty parts which is why i cut the video early when i was looking for parts for the um bulldozer Although, I have noticed a trend where, um, well recently, where uh, Project Zomboid has become too reliant on other people's mods. And now that I think about it, I agree. A lot. Because things like, uh, games like FIFA, they're sold in, they're sold by the developer that made Oh my god. As I was saying, games like FIFA, they're made by a developer, solely by a developer, they get feedback, and then they fix it, and that's it. Whereas Project Zomboid has been in development for the last decade. Um... I wouldn't be surprised if it was in development before GTA 5 came out, uh, to be honest. Um, 27, do I have the capacity? Whereas Project Zomboid I view heavily as more of a people's game, because this game is heavily influenced by the community that plays it. Like the mods that we were just talking about aren't made by the devs, they're made by the community and modders. Which... If you've ever played vanilla Project Zomboid, you will know what I'm talking about. You can't play it. You can't play it just... You can't play just Project Zomboid on its own. Because there's... After a certain amount of time, there's nothing to do. And I admit that in this there's equally nothing to do after a certain point but it's so much extended that it makes a massive difference because this way there's stuff to explore there's stuff that you can do there's things that you can make and there's more actions that you can do in a modded world versus vanilla now i don't know if you'll agree but that's what I've kind of been feeling as though as of late. And I know I've not played it very long, but to be honest, that's how it's getting. Now, I still love the game, um, otherwise I wouldn't have a fucking channel around it, but I still love the game, um, and I'm still going to play it, but, and I'm still going to think of stuff that I can make videos around but whether that's even more mods I'm not sure whether they add something to the game I'm not sure it will most likely be a mod but I don't know there's a lot more I could say uh, 
like about stuff such as the skill system some of the skills being pointless but that's it's kind of irrelevant to me if the skills are pointless then i'm just better off not doing them and not bitching about them so this is why we need a wall by the way okay that's a pretty successful first one how many did we get I'm just going to say we got a lot, because we did. I can't be bothered to count. And the thing is, realistically, we can never have too many logs, because realistically, we'll just build something else. Also, I've decided to leave this forest alone, because ultimately, I realized we were destroying uh, stuff that would keep us hidden. But for when we are back over here. Obviously, we're going to move. But that's still not... It's a little bit down the line. Not too far, but it's not near. Tell you what, though. If the, if the police did one thing right, it was making these cars. They did well. Great. Well, I think that's my sign to stop. Yeah. Let's stop. Also, I'm sorry that yesterday's video was a bit shorter. Okay, this car's stacked and I can't hold anymore. So we're gonna need to go. I'd love to get that trailer. That trailer would actually. I'm just gonna poke it round. There we go. There you go. Oh, you know what? We might as well just go back. Yeah, go back. Load them all. And then get back to the house. Because that will be a really good haul. Okay. We're essentially going home with like 35 logs. Which should be more than enough. I'm going to start sawing them tomorrow and also I'm not going to bother taking them out of the car when I get home purely because I gotta live man okay so the general plan for this whoops for this world is we're gonna carry on making the base down here just because it'll be nice to go to whenever we want to fight uh, we're gonna make our main base on the island that was a few videos ago and we're also going to I'm gonna find a few more places that I can make a base purely because I want to because I'm also gonna take cars like these to the um, main base as well because there's also a box truck that I want to take which I actually haven't sh that would be a good idea I'll do it in the morning that'll be the end of the video I'm gonna take the box truck to here because that that's a real it's actually a really nice car that I want to show you guys sorry that was my mother she just lost her virginity she had to tell me um, I am going to go and scavenge some cans of food um, Oh yeah, I also got some traps. I think they're in the other car, the police car. But that also is good because that means we'll have some meats that we can eat with rabbits and shit. Might as well just take all this stuff as well. Oh, steak. I am actually going to quickly check this house though. I think I've already been in here because there's no food there. Perfect. All right. I'm going to probably not sleep but kill some time. But I'll see you guys in the morning anyway. Okay. I'm off to go and see the box truck. However, I am going to find another car to leave there because I don't want to use either of mine because I have to teach them. Found one. It's also shit, so we can fuck it up as much as we want. Like that! 
There it is. We've got it. I'll show you it back at the house because this, I actually just want to take care of this car. I want to marry it. Okay, this is the truck. How much does this thing hold? 309, 369. Okay, but well that's going to help us out a lot because I'm not sure whether we can attach this to this, but if we can try and that means we can get 429, which is basically 430 with my character included. So yeah, we've got 439 towing capacity here in total. Alright, that's going to do for now. I'll see you guys in a bit. Uh, let me know if you like this video, by the way, because I do this stuff quite a bit. I just kind of go around and do shit. So... Um, like chopping with wood but if you want me to do that and talk then great I can do that more if you don't then I will go and kill myself so I shall see you guys in a bit take care and peace